Good morning, everyone. Welcome back. Um, someone wrote in named Laura and wanted to know if I could recommend a good angel reader. I really don't have a recommendation for a good angel reader. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm a skeptic, as you know, when it comes to doing this work, and I'm all about the evidence and the proof in the here and now. It's really difficult when you go to an angel reader and they, you know, they pull a card and they say, oh, this angel is around you or that angel is around you. And I really am a firm believer that in order to find out what energies are around you, it's a personal journey that you yourself have to experience. I love Doreen Virtue cards. You know, there's certain decks that I just really, really love. And I will tell people, you know, just get a deck that calls to you an angel card deck from Doreen Virtue and pull, um, you know, set the intention because everything in the metaphysical world is, is through intention. Open the deck every morning, you know, spread the deck out and set the intention that you want to pick a card uh, with an angel who will stay close to you that day and a message that you need. And, um, you know, just say a little prayer and, and set the intention yourself and let God guide you. Let, let the angels guide you rather than a person who really, uh, you know, it's about the money. So you just do that, you pick a card, and uh, and it's amazing sometimes because people always seem to pick the right card, okay? So um, when I do my meetups at the center, I have anybody come here, any groups come here, I always keep a deck of Dorian Virtue cards out, spread. It's the 15 uh, Archangel card deck that I use. There's uh, uh, three cards for each Archangel, and I mix them, and I spread them out before the meetup, before they... Uh, you know, the session begins, and as the people come in, they each pick one, and we'll look at it, and they'll all comment and say, oh my gosh, this is just the uh, advice I needed tonight, or I do feel very connected to this angel. So I think it's a personal journey, and uh, I think it's really important that people understand that. It's better to, uh, to do it yourself. Everything is better if you do it yourself. Personal journey that you yourself have to share between God and Spirit. So I hope that answers your question, and as always, I leave you in God's love and light.